have ravaged multiple states across the south with hail, wind and tornadoes in places like Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia, Ohio, Indiana and of course here in Kentucky. WBKO's Derek Parham is in Smith's Grove where residents are working through the storm's aftermath. Hey Derek. Hey there, Jean. As far as damages over here in Smith's Grove, I talked to Mayor David Stiffy just a little while ago, and he let me know that there have been no reported injuries or casualties, which is positive news so far. However, as you can see right here behind me, as other than any power outages, the main concern today are uprooted trees causing property damage all over the city. And I've seen plenty of neighbors out helping each other to clean up debris today, but it does seem like a full recovery is going to take some time. I talked to a few people around the neighborhood and some local business owners, and it sounds like there are plenty of crews on hand working through the night to at least get roads and sidewalks cleared ahead of time. Middle of the night, I heard chainsaws and tractors clearing off the street because our street had three big trees that came down. And whether it was the locals or, or the county itself, but they clear out the road, so we have one, one lane people can get in and out of. Now, as far as those power outages go, after talking to Mayor Stiffy, it doesn't seem like there's much of a timeline for when those will be back online. But around the neighborhood, it does seem like there are quite a few homes still without electricity. Uh, until we find out more, we'll keep you updated right here on WBKO News. I'm Derek Parham, reporting out of Smith's Grove. Smith's Grove, back to you, Gene.